Fresh from scoring his first Bundesliga goal, Felix Akub is aiming to help Bremen continue their impressive away form this season, although Marco Rosa's Gladbach had beaten Bayern in their last home game. Gladbach certainly had more of the ball in the first half, but it was Bremen who created the two best chances before the break. The first of them came just before the half hour when Romano Schmidt let fly and the 20-year-old was only denied a wonderful first goal for Werder by a stunning save from Jan Sommer. Ten minutes after that, Sommer needed one of his defenders to come to his rescue as the Swiss international's attempted interception gave Agu the chance to score in back-to-back -back Bundesliga games. However, Matthias Ginter got himself in the right place to clear away, much to his keeper's relief. And given those opportunities, it would have been understandable if Florian Kofelt had felt a bit disappointed with the half-time scoreline of 0-0. Gladbach had a bit more urgency after the introduction of Lars Stindl and Laszlo Benesch just before the hour. And Benesch provided the assist for the opening goal midway through the second half. As his free kick was guided in perfectly by Nico Elvedi for his first Bundesliga goal of the season. However, the Foles had let Leeds slip on a number of occasions this term, including in the 96th minute in their last match. And they had a couple of nervy moments late on in this one. With substitute Milot Rashica's strike almost creeping in and then almost rebounding in off Sommer. Another player from the Bremen bench had an opportunity right at the end too, but Leonardo Bittencourt couldn't keep his effort down as Borussia held on to make it 10 points from the last 12 available. Gladbach 1, Werder 0.